Hey guys, this is Shelly, and I just wanted to get a video out to all of the kids in kids ministry here at Oak Hills. Whether you see us on a Wednesday night, on a Sunday morning, older kids, younger kids, I want you to know that we're thinking about you, that we miss you, that we're thinking about moms and dads as well at this really kind of weird time, and we're praying for all of you. Um, I'm going to be trying to send a video each Monday just to kind of check in, see how everybody's doing, and on Wednesdays, just to keep some normal Wednesday routine, I'm going to send a lesson and a memory verse, and it was so great to hear from all all of you that uh, let me know that you did a memory verse last week. We're going to find some way to a uh, creative way to use those points. As a part of our Wednesday curriculum uh, in opening worship, we would do wow, pow, holy cow. And a wow was something great that happened in our week that we wanted to share with our friends. A pow was something not so great that we wanted to get rid of. And a holy cow was a way we had seen God work in our week. So I want to share with you my wow, pow, and holy cow. My wow for the week was that my daughter got home from London safely and my family and I are all in really good health. And I want to give five claps to all those teachers out there that are working through this online remote learning and to all the healthcare providers that are on the uh, front lines. We thank you and we love you. My POW is something I want to get rid of is just the bad attitude that we all kind of sometimes fall into and that sense of hopelessness. Guys, we got a God that's much bigger than anything else and he has got this and he's with us each and every step of the way. So we're just going to get rid of that sense of uh, hopelessness. Whoosh! And our holy cow is the way we've seen God work in our community and the different uh, acts of kindness and the way we see people kind of pulling together. I was out on a run this morning and uh, I saw that somebody had written some messages in chalk on their sidewalk. And I just thought that was so uplifting as I was going along and just something really cool to see. Now, guys, as the um, as the weeks go on, we're going to go into homeschooling and it's going to be kind of frustrating. It's going to be new. It's going to be all these things. So I just want to remind you to extend some extra grace to yourself. Yeah, this is new, but you know what? It's going to be OK and we're all going to be fine and extend some grace to your moms and dads. This is new for them, too. They're not sure what they're doing and how this is all going to go. But you know what? We're all in this together and we're going to be just fine. Um, please, in the meantime, wash your hands, get outside from time to time, uh, get plenty of rest, and remember to kind of keep your distance from some people. I love hearing from you by email, so if you want to email me, shan at oakhills.net, that would be great. If there's something you need, do not hesitate to contact me. And I would just want to end this video today with just a, uh, a little word of scripture. This is from Philippians 4, 6 through 7. Don't worry about anything. Instead, pray about everything. Tell God what you need and thank him for all he has done. Then you will experience God's peace, which exceeds anything we can understand. His peace will guard your hearts and minds as you live in Jesus Christ. Remember, pray often and God is in this with us. I miss you. I love you. And I hope to see you very soon.